This is Magic Sword. <laughs> magic Sword, Golden Axe. Any adjective in front of a bladed weapon makes for an excellent video game title, let's be honest. Sharp, knife, pointy stick. Hopefully they'll make that in the future. Magic Sword is a game I'm not that familiar with, but it comes with the Final Fight Double Impact Collection. The downloadable game from Capcom for Xbox Live and PlayStation Network. This is the PlayStation 3 version. Magic Sword. Uh, this game reminds me of a side-scrolling version of Gauntlet, in a way. It's just complete mayhem. When you add together two-player gameplay, both with secondary characters, in the later levels, it's, it's just insane. I think I spent about $600 worth of quarters playing through the game, because at some point, I just stopped dodging things. It seemed more efficient just to run through everything while continuing to fire. But let me back up to the start of the game where it makes more sense. Okay, we've got a story, wizards, chicks in metal, bikinis, axes. Alright, we're good to go. Magic Sword does have some interesting gameplay. Fans of 2D side-scrolling fantasy adventure games might dig this one. You get it with Final Fight anyway, so if you like 2D side-scrolling beat-em-ups, you should certainly own Final Fight. So let's see, it's a one or two player game, you have a sword, and if you let it charge up, you can shoot things. What's cool about this game is that you can unlock prisoners, or, or, or your friends, or whoever the hell they are, stuck behind bars, and they come out and assist you. They're like the dog in Shinobi, a shadow dancer. Except they won't curl up at your feet and keep them warm. Except for the one guy, he might. You only have two buttons, you can jump, you can attack, you can hit both buttons at the same time, use magic, which depletes your health, kind of like the special move in Final Fight. The variety of assisting characters is what makes this game really cool. You've got a chick with a bow and arrow, like some kind of guy that throws an axe, there's wizards, a ninja. He's my favorite. You collect keys, you can free those guys, they level up and get stronger as the gameplay becomes more and more frantic. Frantic is today's word. This game is sponsored by the word frantic and the number 3.14. Because I'm drinking coffee, and some pie would be great right now. I don't have any, though. Mm, blueberry. And just uh, as with Final Fight, you can change the screen to look like an arcade cabinet, or set it to look like this full screen. Now another player is about to join my game. Iced Kong. Prepare to have your inbox flooded. Two-player gameplay is where this game shines, so I'm glad that he or she joined in to help slaughter evil numerous credits at a time. Because I think that we both just adopted the same gameplay style of just running through everything. The biggest problem I had with two players in this game is that I would frequently just forget which person I was controlling, because there's like four characters on screen at any one time, not to mention all the bad guys. So accidentally, at times, I would just follow the wrong characters, and then the next thing I know, my guy's actually burning in a pit of lava. But uh, regardless, two-player gameplay is definitely the way to go with Magic Sword. I suppose that if you play the game a lot, you'll actually figure out different enemies in the attack patterns, but just charging into this one is sheer chaos. Magic Sword. Not one of my favorites, but kind of fun. And it comes with Final Fight Double Impact. This is a recreation of the 1990 arcade machine, and my guess is that you have to play Magic Sword a lot to figure out the ins and outs, because there's more going on in this game than is, than is immediately apparent. You can use a great deal of strategy depending on which of the other characters, the assisting characters you use. 
Maybe not a great deal of strategy, but you can use at least a little bit of strategy. I found that the ninja worked best for me, clearing out enemies with a wide attack pattern, but the wizard, while slow, was quite an effective weapon as well. So even if I suck at this game, that doesn't mean that everybody else will. So thanks to Iced Kong for joining in, and if you like the looks of this game, watch the review of Final Fantasy Double... Watch the Final Fantasy. Watch the review of Final Fight. So many finals. Final Fight Double Impact. Two games for one price is always a good thing.